Grandma. It's my favorite. That play won us the state pennant. Oh, your Coach Brown must be very special. You bet. There he is. He's really neat. Oh, there's Margo. Boy, was she mad. She blamed me for falling. But the coach said it was a good thing I was there. It looks like your coach knows a special guy when he sees him. Oh, Grandma. Gosh, the party. I've got to get to the gym. I had that trophy made for the coach's going away present. Uh, wait, Alan. I'll get you a chair. No time for that. I... Whoa! Oh, Alan Anderson. Are you all right? Well, I'm fine, and so's this. I better get going. I'm afraid not, young man. I asked you to wait for a chair. Now it looks like you have to clean up this mess before you go. But I can't. I have to get the decorations to the gym and... You know the rules, Alan. This was your mistake. Why am I so stupid? I'll bring the refreshments and help you with Coach Brown's party. After my workout, I'm warming up for our tennis game tomorrow. You know, I count on you to keep me young. Way to go, dummy. Two, four, six, eight. Who do we appreciate? Coach Brown! Yay! How humiliating! Glomer, get me down! Why? Glomer playing basketball. That's basketball, Glomer. And you play with this. Hey, cut the conversation and get me down! Why don't we get her to hang the banner while she's up there? Great idea, except Alan is bringing it. Coach Brown, you okay? Oh, sure, Alan. You ought to know by now that I'm a tough old bird. Oh, I'm sure gonna miss this place and all you kids. Especially you, Alan. You were always a big help to me. You can come back to shoot a few baskets, can't you? Well, that's a great idea. How about right now? I'll race you to the gym. No! Not the gym! Here comes Alan. It's about time. He can finish this. Uh-oh. He's got Coach Brown with him. Leave it to Alan to do a dumb thing like that. Hi, kids. Hi, Coach. Alan, they need you inside. Alone. Oh, that's okay, Alan. We'll throw some baskets another day. Way to go, Alan. You almost blew the whole dumb surprise. Yeah, and where have you been? We've been doing all of your work. This was supposed to be your party. That does it. Everything I do is wrong. I'm leaving forever. Alan, that's real dumb. See what I mean? You always think I'm dumb. Alan, wait! No! Clover, quick, do something! Okay, you're asking for it! Alan, friend, we need to have man to gloomy talk, huh? Don't waste your breath, Clover. I wish everyone would just forget they knew Alan Anderson. They'd be a lot better off without me around. You're making strange askings. But, <laughs> Glomer doing. Hey, neat! I feel better already! What did you do, Glomer? Glomer make everyone forgetting you. <laughs> That's a good one, Glomer. <laughs> What have you done to Coach Brown's retirement party? Why would we give Coach Brown a party? This is for the young lady's tea. <gasps> Gosh, Margo, why did you break your arm? Where have you been? Everyone at school knows I broke it at the basketball game last week. But you weren't hurt. You landed in my cart. Your cart? I've never even seen you before. Who is that kid? Beats me. Here you go, dearies. Here's your refreshments. Grandma! What happened to you? You look so... so old. 
I am old, Sonny, and I'm not your grandma. I never had any grandkids. Uh, maybe if I had, I wouldn't feel so old. So this is what it's like without Alan Anderson. Glomer, you've got to fix things. People, persons not knowing what they want, then they blame Glomer. <laughs> no magic in front of strangers. Come on, Mrs. Anderson. We'll help you out to the bus. Now I've really let everybody down. And they don't even remember it was me. <laughs> Listen, Punky, you've got to help me. Sure, Albert. It's Alan, and I want things to be the way they used to be. Tell Glomer to change things back. Glomer? Did you say Glomer? Hey! We've got trouble. That kid knows about Glomer. Wait, Punky friend. I'm needing to tell you about Alan. Not now, Glomer. Oh, no! Now what will I do? All clear. There's no sign of that boy. We should be more careful with Glober. Now will you be listening to me? Punky, you have a visitor. Glober, save it for later. What did you say your name was? Adam? Aaron? It's Alan. Alan Anderson. Please, Punky, make Glomer change things back. Glomer? I thought he said his name was Alan. Uh, that's right. Alan Glomer. And he has to leave. But, 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 go home. That's the problem. I don't have a home now. Hey, maybe Coach Brown can help me. Sorry about your problem, kid, but I'm just a bat boy and a locker jockey. You used to be a great coach. I left that job years ago. I never could find kids who really cared. But I did, coach. You were my hero. Funny, I don't remember you. Now I dress up in this silly costume and hand out bats. Yo! <laughs> if you want this job, kid, it's all yours. Thanks a lot. I need the money now that I'm on my own. This is rich. The Cubs are offering some great entertainment between innings. Isn't that that weird boy? Yeah, what's his name? Alan. Oh, boy. Uh, we'll be right back, Henry. Whoa, No time for talking. Action what we need here. I've been trying to tell you. Alan ready to be Alan again. My magic made it like Alan never being born. That's ridiculous, Glomer. I never forget someone I knew. Would I? I'm so lonely. Glomer, you know you shouldn't use your magic like that. Are you sure he's our friend? No doubt about it. Okay, if you say so, Glomer. You stay here, and we'll go get him. Hey, kid, you're holding up the game. And those guys aren't too happy about it. Get ready! Here he comes! No! No! Leave me alone! Everything's okay now, Alan. Hey, me! You called me Alan. That means you remember me. Isn't it wonderful? Margo, your cast is gone. A cast? Get serious. I'm out of Baltimore, this beautiful arm. Well, this is a wonderful surprise party. I didn't think anybody would care this much about one old coach. Thanks a lot, kids. It was all Alan's doing. Yeah, who else but Alan would think of a football-shaped cake? Oh, that's my Alan for you. I don't know what I'd do without him. Well, I guess having me around isn't so bad after all. That's right, Alan. But we're just glad there's only one of you.